Hello, everyone. I am so excited here. I feel, felt like I had to do my presentation today and talk about the challenge I'm going to be doing tomorrow by bringing out my beloved pet snake, Jasper, who you can see is um, actually right over by my, my back right now, if you can't see him. Um, so I want to talk a little bit about shedding and how I know that many of my friends and my clients have been reaching out to me in the last couple of weeks because there's been a lot of up leveling that's been happening. So much energy is shifting right now and it's all really important for us to see what's coming up for review and see what we no longer want to hold on to and see what we really want to release for the new year. I love the time of the solstice because the days, at least in the northern hemisphere, become very, very short and very very dark and early on and it's a time for going in and looking at what's no longer working for us and what we want to shift and, and taking that time in meditation oh the snake's going down my back right now oh there he goes um and so what i wanted to do is i wanted to get online for the next three days and i'm telling you about it today but we're going to be meeting online in my private facebook group i'm also going to be doing this streaming it on instagram talking about how we can transmute those dark blockages that are inside of us the things that come up that are our shadow, that we are ready to let go of so that we can step more fully into our power and more into our purpose in our light. Because when the days get shorter and we do have that phase of hibernation, it is really important to see what it is that we're ready to shed. And I have my, my sweet little friend Jasper here. I actually call him friend because he's so cute. Um, and I have his snake skin here as well. And you, as you can see, when snakes are outgrowing what's no longer serving them, they really step into that phase of outgrowing the old, just like we do, but we don't necessarily have to shed our skin. But when we do let go of what's no longer serving us, we can really step into our, pur our purpose, our power, and our passion. And so I wanted to remind you guys to come on live the next three days, I'm going to be coming on live at noon Eastern Standard Time to lead you through three days of shifting out the shadows, those blockages in your energy that are no longer serving so that you can step more fully into your power. And what that looks like is we're not only going to be banishing the old, getting rid of it, but we're going to be listening for what wisdom wants to come through. Because oftentimes when we try to let go of things that aren't serving us, they just keep coming back to us until we learn the lesson as to why they came in the first place. Just like if you have a pain in your back or something in your body that's trying to show you that there's something wrong, we oftentimes have to find out what the underlying message is before we can fully let it go. It's almost like we graduate those lessons. And so I wanted to bring Snake here, my little friend Jasper, as the mascot because he really does show us how effortless it is to shed our skin when we're no longer, you know, in the same state of mind when we want to let go of our of um, old friends. He's totally going down my shirt right now, guys. This is where he's going. He's going to the nice warm spot. Um, when it's time to let go of what no longer serves, it is important to really elevate and to and to come into our new phase of what it is that we're really calling in for ourselves. And so I want to ask you guys to join me in this playful way now that I have a snake down my shirt and moved around my belly. I'm probably going to go so I can take care of this. But I wanted to ask you guys to show up for the next three days to learn the different ways that you can up level and shift out what's no longer serving you so that you can step into your purpose and your power just in time for the new year. So I'm calling this the three day shadow shifting challenge. And I'll see you guys live tomorrow starting at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I hope to see you there soon. Bye. <laughs>